And joining us now is Pat Carey. He is a former prosecutor. You just told me you would defend Lindsay. Is this community service? She's what? serving the community. L listen, every <laughs> everybody wants to jump all over Lindsay, right? Yeah. Because when they hear about what she's doing, that's not community service. But here's the issue. The issue is the court approved her mm -hmm. to, to abide by the conditions of this program. Her conditions where you meet and greet fans should count toward your community. Here's her, here's her probation condition. Abide by the orders of the Community Service Volunteers of London. Now, every Superior Court judge knows if, if you go off the list, okay, there is a list of approved community service programs that are vetted, and judges do not want to go off that list. When they go off that list, they this, make their bed. This one's in London, though. You have to question. Uh, correct. <laughs> I, I agree. And I would not have approved it, but the, but the issue is that the court approved it. Yeah. So okay. Lindsay is abiding by those terms. She but, did but, not violate probation. But let's let's talk about how this. Yeah. How, how does this look? I mean, it, it right. If you're Sean Holly, you're going to say all of these hours in. A absolutely. It it does look absurd in the public eye. It looks absurd. But the bottom line is, the prosecutor is going to have to prove. By a preponderance of the evidence, did she violate the terms in the in? I'm sorry, the terms of her probation, mm -hmm. and she did not. She yeah. abided by those terms, whether or not the public feels it's absurd or not. Quick question for you: sure. If Bob was ever in trouble, yes, he leaves the studio here. He's she always you're happened. always attacked by a throng of fans. <laughs> True. If he comes to court and says, "By the way, that was my community service as well." I mean, what I'm asking is, people other than Lindsay Lohan have they tried to use these kinds of? Well, you know. Uh, People try to get things approved in court all the time. If the court approves it, they can do it. But, you know, usually, usually the case is for someone like me or you, you're going to have to uh, go to a community service program that's off the Superior Court approved list. And if the judge strays off of that list, then, you know, the court's going to have to deal with that. So but could the judge now just say, hey, I'd like, these are the hours you still need to complete. You didn't do it. Here, go back and complete these. I I think that is a possibility, but in the end, um, I don't think Lindsay technically violated probation. So while on probation, the court can order her to do whatever they want, really, per se. They can order her to redo the hours. Um, you and know, jail but, time, potentially. Yes, the prosecutor wants jail time, but, you know, uh, is that something uh, that we really want to spend our time on, putting Lindsay Lohan in jail? Uh, if, if the court really wants her to do these hours, what they should do is look at that list that everybody else has to go off of, find a court-approved program, mm -hmm. force her to finish the remaining hours on that court-approved program. If not, um, you know, she'll be uh, left to do what she wants. I guess I see your point. If it was approved by the community service program, that was approved by the court, then... Then she didn't technically do anything. You're else. saying we should all leave Lindsay a low hand. I'm a low hand, true. Yeah. That's a good way to put it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Pat Carey. I'm tired about talking about this anyway. <laughs> sure. All right. Thanks, uh, of course. Bye.